Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and thanks for joining us tonight at the Millennium Stage. This evening's performance is presented as part of the DC Jazz Festival. And now, won't you please welcome to the stage, ladies and gentlemen, Lenny White. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, this is a beautiful opportunity to uh, come here to the Kennedy Center. And I have the privilege of introducing some new constellations in the jazz universe to you today. Uh, I actually think this is amazing because at uh, 625, I'd be eating dinner right now. <laughs> so we really appreciate you coming out and sharing this time with us. And I'd like to uh, take this opportunity, as I said, to introduce some very stellar musicians. Um, they're at the ripe old age of 16. And really, 17. <laughs> and I, I don't want to take up a lot of time talking about them because basically they'll talk about themselves by the way they play. But what is interesting that I, you know, like young people gravitate to the arts, whether it's music or dance or, or whatever. Um, and you know they, they have an affinity for the music and they play it and it's great, they become prodigies or whatever. But I think what's different about both of these two gentlemen here is that they, they play all kinds of music, but I think jazz music chose them because the way that they understand this art form is uncanny. I mean, like there are people that are four times their age, but they really do understand this art form, and it's really a pleasure for me to be able to play with them, number one, and introduce them to you. On the bass, from Inglewood, New Jersey, Daryl Johns. <laughs> from Georgia, not Atlanta, <laughs> Tbilisi, Georgia, Becca Goshesvili. <laughs> I, re I recently met uh, Daryl. Daryl's father's a great drummer, and we actually live in the same neighborhood. And I, I heard him play, and I was like, are you kidding me? Is it but I met Becca when he was 11, and um, we played, and then he came to the United States, and I couldn't believe how much he had grown. And both of these gentlemen, I, I have no words, so I'm just gonna let them play for you. Actually, the first tune we played was an original composition called Elsbop, which is on an album that I did with Becca. And the second tune that we did is a Becca Goshesvili composition, and that is called Fourth B. And I think basically, you gotta tell me if I'm wrong, but like, you know, there are three Bs, it was Beethoven, Bach, and Bill Evans, <laughs> and Brad Maldow. So those are the four Bs <laughs> that, that you we're going to play a, a composition now that actually is on Becca's CD um, that I wrote for two friends of mine. And uh, it's titled Chicken Stand. Thank you. 
Thank you. Today just happens to be uh, the birthday of Becca's father. And I think um, probably his dad is going to be watching this in Tbilisi, so I'm going to let him say something to his dad. Hello, everybody. Uh I'm gonna do a little uh, short dedication here. I wrote some tune uh, for my father. My father is in Georgia now, and maybe, uh, not baby, I'm sure he's watching me now. And uh, I would say, uh, happy birthday to my father. Uh, I hope you, you all gonna join me. No? <laughs> and, uh, I'll play I'll play my tune what I wrote for my father and uh yeah happy birthday to him thank you
Rebecca Gorsiusvili. I, I hate to be like um, someone that pitches, but we do have CDs for sale. And I know like uh, 4th of July is coming up. You might want to give it as a gift for the 4th of July, you know, I don't know. <laughs> uh, but <clears throat> we are after the uh, performance, we'll be in the back and we'll uh, sign some CDs for you. Becca has uh, a CD that uh, was, just came out and um, I have some goodies in the back too. We're gonna actually play a piece of music now from Becca's CD, and this is a piece that he wrote called Coco.
Billy, Daryl Johns, thank you so much, thank you, we have some CDs for you in the back, thanks. 